hi guys welcome back to my channel so today as you already know i have another dollar tree video go figure anyways guys and i'm wearing my little skull skeleton whatever little earrings look at her little skirt so cute anyways i came across these yes i just grabbed something right and just started my video <laughs> this is um you get 48 ounces i picked up three my daughter has one downstairs because she's taking it for the boys. Um, so yeah, and this is the Fruit Punch by Very Fine. I figured this is nice to have for the kids. And I like to have these in hand. This, I picked up four, I have two downstairs I forgot to bring up. I picked up four, I um, like to have these because sometimes you use all the milk or your hubby or the kids and they don't say there's no milk so and then my grandson in the middle of the night like at three or four o'clock in the morning decides that he wants chocolate milk and so when you open the refrigerator and there's no milk it's always wonderful to have this as a backup so yes that's why i like to have these in hand all the time and this is one quart which is 32 ounces so i picked the four because I don't want to go through that nightmare again where I'm like, I'm not going to you at three or four o'clock in the morning. You don't have to go to a gas station because Walmart's usually are open 24 hours. Not anymore since all this pandemic stuff. So I'm not going to gas station to pay six, seven dollars for a gallon. Of milk. No, my daughter picked up these coffee mate French vanilla. She enjoys this. Usually we go to Walmart and we buy um, creamer, but you know, when you run out and you just want, before you do groceries or whatever, you want to pick something up, you just have these. And these are eight ounces. We picked up two. Obviously, two dollars for these is not a great deal. But again, when you just know you're just not going to be doing grocery shopping anytime soon, or it's, you know, you just pick them up to have them in hand. She wanted to try this peppermint mocha 9.5 um, ounces of it's an iced latte chill coffee drink. Is peppermint flavor I don't know that's not my cup of tea but she wanted to give it a go and then with the drinks um we have filtered water here in my house I can just grab a bottle and fill it up but now I know where my son gets the laziness from <laughs> because I was like I just want to buy I don't want to fill a bottle I just want to grab a bottle and go so I just wanted to have a bottle of water sometimes I just want to get have one in my nightstand you know so that's the reason behind that. But now I sound like my son. I was just being lazy. Um, oh my God, guys. I don't know if I hauled these or not. I don't remember. But if I did, I don't know. I don't know if I was telling you about these. Um, the only reason why I picked these up is because of my son. I don't know if I showed you guys that. Oh my God, I'm so lost. He's a little lazy. So I decided to make his life easier. He doesn't want to um pour something in a cup anyways i think i showed you guys that i'm sorry i'm all over the place i have this pillow because i woke up with my back on one side oh my god hot kids i pick these up all the time these are two ounces only there's not the greatest for your money to me it's not you can get a better deal probably at walmart or something but i always have these in hand for the boys so i picked that up I think this is not bad. It's 28 pieces of six lits original. These are pretty good, guys. Pretty good to have. And I just want to throw these in my the my kids snack bin. You know, throw a little candy in there once in a while, chips or whatever, so they know if they're in the mood for something sweet. Um, I left. I guys. Anyways, let me finish this. So if they're in the mood for something sweet, they know to go downstairs and just grab something there. I was just going like this and I was just thinking about how I was telling you guys on my last haul. I'm always touching my hair, blah, blah, blah. And today I said, let me just do an ugly bun on this hair. And I'm like, oh my God, I have all these little hairs sticking up. So I'm still touching my hair. Please forgive me. This is not a great deal because, look guys, for a dollar. This is the Roasted and Salted by the brand Wonderful No Shells Pistachio. My daughter and I love to have these in our bag or whatever. You get hungry, it's just nice to pick up and have a little snack instead of indulging in the wrong, nasty, sweet, wonderful 
deliciousness of junk food so it's just nice to have and these are only 0 0.75 ounces again you don't get enough i mean not enough you don't get a lot for your dollar but i don't know if you ever gone to walmart target mm. pistachios are just ridiculous and expensive and i'm like why it's just nuts why are they so expensive anyways we picked my daughter picked that up to have my grandson is waiting for gum he's right there driving me crazy uh, these are the double bubble and these are the five ounces mix of gum and so my daughter and i always have gum in hand all the time you know in our purse like you have some at work or whatever but um yeah so pick that up then i found these golden silo bakery six pre-sliced plain english muffin they're nice and soft my daughter was like oh we should i walked away from them my daughter's like you don't want to grab those i'm like for what she's like for breakfast or something the kids so i figured okay some ham cheese and an egg toast them with a little butter good to go you have a breakfast sandwich i started going to dunkin donuts and paying like two for five dollars is the cheapest you probably get when you get sandwiches like this so you get six of them six good sandwiches for them to have and where do i want to go with next i just picked up one lonely bag that's all they had their chicken jerky strip for charlie my dog real chicken is the number one ingredient it says no artificial flavor long lasting chew not for charlie this will be gone in a second so i picked that up guys i'm in a weird spot here my phone is just flashing and flashing guys because i cracked my screen yesterday and it's i just feel like i'm in a it looks like a disco ball and it's like oh my back and it's just flashing in my face and i'm like oh my god like it's just so annoying anyways let's keep on going my daughter always picks this up for my grandson these are this is the firefly anti-cavity fluoride rinse and this is the eight ounces pick that up for him and she picked up the kids crest toothpaste no explanation neither you guys already know um i wanted to try these sometimes i like to have like little uh, adhesive dots and Dollar tree carries some other ones but i found this one at crafter square magical adhesive dots so you know when you're doing a little project or you just want something to stick on the wall or whatever and you don't want to like put a nail i like to put a few of these in behind the frames and just you know lay it against the wall and press and I never tried this brand, but the other ones work pretty well, so that's why I picked this up. 72 pieces. Now you're going to hear my grandson chewing gum all crazy back there, guys. And I picked up the little mini um, hose up to 0 0.2 pounds. Not a lot, but I picked these up just in case I put like the... Because I bought some frames that fits the calendar sheets when you want to frame them that everybody's been going crazy looking for them so i picked that up just to have in hand so i can frame some of those for christmas and put them like against my kitchen counter so i picked this up in case i just want to hang it up on my backsplash and i don't want to put a hole or a nail or whatever i want to see if this is going to work for what i want to do and you already know if you see this you already know what i want to do yes i just want to do like a little christmas sleigh thing with some flowers i'm gonna spray paint these black break this part off and then just glue them and probably just put them on my counter that's why i picked these up i probably have some in my dollar tree closet <laughs> but i didn't want to use those because i like the black and the and the plastic ones clear plastic ones just in case like when i need them so I picked up these just to like i can spray paint them and do whatever so that's why i picked that up for a project and these were really cute guys look at this i have a dollar tree bag here look how cute this is it says christmas cheer hold on put it right there christmas cheer guys it's so cute and so i picked that one off <laughs> and this one was my favorite i think jingle juice so I don't really drink. I really don't drink. It's rare. Wine gives me a headache. I'm not much of a drinker, drinker. Like once in a while, I'll probably have a little drink and it'll be something girly. Like, let me tell you, something sweet or like pina colada or something. 
I don't care. I'll still pour it in here and make it look cute for the holidays for myself or my daughter. And so I picked those up for that. Then I came across these cute little candles. I seen them before. I, I, the last time I was there, I saw them and I was like, mm, I don't know. But then of course you see someone hauling them and giving you ideas what they can use them for. I'm like, oh, I should have picked some up. So I picked up two and I think I'm just gonna put them on a nice little candle holder or I don't know, our tea tray or maybe just put them in my guest bathroom for Christmas. I'll find a place to put them, but they were really cute. The girl that hauled them, she said they remind her of like a Christmas sweater. And I was like, oh yeah, that's true. They have no scent, but I thought they were really pretty for the holidays. So I picked that up. And I picked this up only because I know that when I need it, I'm not going to find it. And I finally came across them today and I was like, you know what? I'm going to pick that up because when I decide to buy this, I'm going to be like, oh, I should have picked that up. And I didn't. And this is just white, like white sand. And I, I don't know if you guys remember, I picked up two little glass um, jars that I want to put like white sand after the holidays are over, guys. I am ready to redecorate. I'm getting ready for spring, guys. I'm always ahead of the game ahead of the game like i'm dying to put my christmas tree already like it's ridiculous usually i do it right after thanksgiving when do you guys put up your christmas tree i want to know is it me am i the only one like already to like i'm ready for my christmas tree i know everybody's still in the halloween spirit and all that stuff but i am ready to put my christmas tree i might leave it just with my clear lights on and not do anything else until i'm ready to decorate for like decorate like after Thanksgiving dinner. But I don't know. And then I'm the kind of person that if I do things too early and then I'll get tired. I'm like, oh, why did I put that tree up so early? So you guys tell me. Are you guys with me? You ready to decorate? Is it just me? Should I? Shouldn't I? 2020 has been rough and I'm just ready to like enjoy. Enjoy the rest of it, you know? Anyway, so I picked this up because, like I said, when spring comes and I'm ready to take everything down and restart decorating for the spring and summer, whatever, I want to put these in those little jars that I bought in some cute succulents and call it a day around my tables and my shelves. Like, I want everything really nice. And I don't know. I want, like, plants and refresh and airy and I don't know if all that stuff makes sense. But, all right, guys. And the last few items that I have to show you is all the same thing but in different pattern and I'm so excited because I finally found one of the things that I was looking for and I found the Superman sock oh my god so yes I found Superman I didn't find Wonder Woman so sad Superman and these are women 9 to 11 right there found Superman I found Batman and the stripes then I found Batman like this. And look. Oh my God. I was so excited, guys. I found four more that I don't have. It's ridiculous because <sighs> my Dollar Tree closet, guys. But, um, but, 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 but. I'm going to give all this stuff away. This is not stuff that I'm going to keep or whatever. This is all stuff that I'm going to put in baskets, Christmas gifts, and all that goodie. I love to share. I love to share. Who knows? I might be selling, send, not selling, not selling, guys. No, no, that's not what I meant. Sending some of these to you guys, you know, because that's just how I like to do things, you know. And then um, I have this from Dollar General really quick. I didn't buy a lot. But I wanted to show you guys. Okay, so this is going to be part of my project. It was only a dollar. And it's beautiful as a garden. It really is. I don't want to destroy it. But on that Mary sign, I'm going to either do um, like a pattern or something or paint it black. And on the little Y that looks like a deer, I'm going to put the nose to make them look like uh, Root of the Red Nose Reindeer. Yes, it's going to look so cute. I'm going to show you guys. So that's why I picked that up. And I'm a sucker for polka dots. Polka dots and gnome. It's all about my life. So I picked this up because I thought it was cute if I want to tie like a little ribbon to something or whatever for the holidays or anything. Even Valentine's. So I picked that up. 
And my last item, guys. My last item before I let you guys go. You know, like, I'm kind of over the red truck thing. I love the truck. I love the truck. But the red truck thing, I'm like, ah, oh, I did it so much already. But look how cute. Like, for a tear tray or just on, on sitting on your shelf for Christmas. I wish it was the clear lights or whatever. I'm not too crazy about the colorful lights. But it lights up. This thing lights up for two dollars. Two dollars. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> I was like, yes, I'm taking this. I wish I can switch the lights, but it's okay. I like it like this too. But on a shelf, on a tear tray, anywhere, any little small little nook that you want to put something for the holidays and decorate. This right here, guys. This right here. Adorable. And that is it, guys. That's all I have for you guys today. I hope you're having an amazing, what is it, Saturday today. Enjoying your weekend with your family. Stay safe. Be kind to one another. Remember, it's free. And if you like this kind of video, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications so it lets you know every time I come with my spending nonsense <laughs> to share with you guys. And that is it, guys. I love you all. Have a great night. And I'll see you all in my next one. Bye.